Blood Glucose Control by kscience.com. We eat starch from plant-based materials. So starch is made of glucose. And this starch is broken down into glucose molecules. And it is amylase that binds the starch and breaks down the starch to glucose. So when we eat starch, glucose levels increase and glucose blood levels must be controlled. And that is what we're gonna talk about now. So when we eat sugary foods, blood glucose levels will increase. As you can see here, blood glucose levels have increased. So we need to reduce the blood glucose levels. And it is the pancreas, pancreas that secretes insulin. Pancreas secretes insulin. Insulin is going to convert glucose. So insulin converts glucose into glycogen, which you can see here, it is converting the glucose molecules into glycogen. So glucose is converted to glycogen. The glycogen is stored in the liver. So the glycogen is stored in the liver and this reduces blood sugar levels. Pause the video here to attempt to practice using the keywords. The answers will follow. When blood glucose levels are low, so now we've got low blood glucose levels. It is the glycogen in the liver. It is the glycogen in the liver that is converted into glucose. And it's the pancreas, pancreas that secretes glucagon, glucagon. Glucagon is secreted into the blood and it converts glycogen to glucose. So the glycogen gets broken down into glucose. This increases blood glucose levels. So glycogen stored in the liver is broken down by glucagon produced by the pancreas and converted into glucose, increasing glucose levels in the blood. Pause the video here to attempt to practice using the keywords. The answers will follow. It's question time. Attempt these questions to check your understanding. I'm now going to explain how insulin helps transport glucose molecules from the blood and into cells. I'm now going to draw blood glucose levels after just eating a meal, so they increase. So this is glucose. So now the pancreas, the pancreas will now secrete insulin. Pancreas secretes insulin into the blood. So now on the surface of the cells, you've got insulin receptors. Insulin receptors are going to be bound by insulin. So the insulin is going to bind the insulin receptors that are on the cells. So these here now the insulin binding the insulin receptors. So the insulin binds the insulin receptors that are on the cells. And this opens glucose channels. Opens glucose channels. So the insulin opens glucose channels in the cells. So now the glucose channels are open, the glucose can enter the cells from the blood. Glucose will leave the blood. So as you can see here, the glucose enters the cells through open glucose channels. This then will reduce the concentration of glucose in the blood. So this will lower the blood glucose levels and increases glucose in the cells for respiration. Press pause to practice using those key words. The answers will follow. Press pause to go through your answers and make any corrections to your mistakes. It's question time. Attempt these questions to check your understanding. Press pause to answer the questions. The answers will follow. And if you're stuck, just rewatch the video. Press pause to go through your answers and make any corrections to your mistakes. Visit kscience.com 
for more free videos, worksheets and quizzes at kscience.com. And don't forget to like and subscribe.